encroached upon not just in India but in other parts of the world too. In a black day for press freedom, Washington Post correspondent Jason Raza, imprisoned in Tehran for more than 14 months, has been convicted following a trial. Jason Raza was arrested in July 2014. According to news reports, Raza gained access to a lawyer after nine months in jail and in an opaque trial, he was charged with espionage and spreading propaganda against the Iranian government. The United States government has repeatedly called on Iranian authorities to release Reza, most recently on the sidelines of the nuclear negotiations which ended in a deal with Iran last month. After news broke out, the American press has slammed Iran government. In a statement, the Washington Post said Iran has behaved unconscionably. This is an indefensible decision by the Revolutionary Court to convict an innocent journalist of serious crimes after the proceedings unfolded in secret with no evidence whatsoever of any wrongdoing. Iran has an abysmal record when it comes to press freedom and ranks 173 out of 180 countries on the Reporters Without Borders global ranking list. Journalists, both domestic and international, are not the only ones targeted by Iran's theocratic government. Many emigres who return to Iran following assurances of safe return by the Rouhani administration have been arrested, prosecuted and sentenced for alleged anti-national crimes.